My name is Swapnil Chaturvedi and I clean toilets for living. People lovingly call me poop guy. <laughs> I call myself the chief toilet cleaner at Samagra and our basic aim is to provide awesome sanitation services to the urban poor. 60% of Indians defecate in open. We call India the open defecation capital of the world. The problem is acute in urban slums because the density of the population is so high. If somebody asks me why did I start this business, there is only one reason, for women's dignity. It goes back to me being a father of a girl child. And she used to say that, Papa, the toilet stinks in my school. And she used to come home every day and run towards the toilet. And that is when we started realizing, even though there are toilets, if they are not maintained properly, people will not use them. The one thing that we look for is whether I will use it or not. Is there air circulation? Is there light? Is there smell? Is there a hand wash station? Is there easy accessibility to water? I used to think that the problem lies in technology. What we realized eventually was that the problem does not mainly lie in the technology, but the psychology. And that's what we are focusing on right now. Once that behavior is changed, usage increases because people want to use them. Now the most visceral reaction that we get is from families that have teenage daughters. They say things like, you have made our lives better. You have made life so convenient and so dignified for our daughters. So when I look at my daughter and I think about her future, this is the kind of service I would like her to have. As kids become adults, they take with them all sorts of hygiene habits so that they don't have these issues. And that is the only way we can live without Facebook, we can live without a smartphone, but we cannot live without relieving ourselves. It's a daily natural activity. Then why such a taboo around it? We should talk about it openly and we should do something about it.